Kyocera is not making any official announcements at this year's CTIA, but it does have a few devices here under uh, glass casing. Unfortunately, we're not able to put our hands on them, but we will get a uh, nice little feature walkthrough from our friendly Kyocera staffer. So the product you're looking at right here is called the M2000. It's a follow-on to our really successful M1000 product. Uh, it's sold at Virgin Mobile under the Wildcard name, uh, also Cricket and several other carriers under the name Lingo. Uh, this takes that product with the full QWERTY keypad in a product space that we really help to initiate, which is a low-cost full QWERTY keypad uh, product. And uh, this will be the next generation. It incorporates the 1.3 megapixel camera, uh, full QWERTY for email, uh, for texting and a real nice sleek design uh, following on from this is our now our third generation in this product category. So you can see it has a USB on the right side as well as a uh, full three and a half millimeter headset jack and support for micro SD cards as well. That's correct. The next product you're looking at is a product that will go into the very affordable uh, color clamshell uh, without a camera. Uh, this is a product that we call the Credo or the S2410. Uh, you can see very nice sleek design on the outside. Uh, the polished chrome band uh, gives it a very attractive look with the soft touch uh, rubberized finish on the outside. Uh, from a feature standpoint, very solid feature set for this affordable price point. Uh, you're looking at a very nice large color display, TFT display inside, a uh, nice big keypad, and uh, and a very robust feature set for the low cost that this phone will, uh, will offer. The last phone in the lineup is a phone that we call the Mellow, or the S1300. Uh, this is going to be a very low cost phone, uh, very basic feature set. Uh, it does have a nice color display, uh, does offer photo caller ID, uh, but this is really targeted at a segment that we call the simplest, the people who are really interested in affordability and really just making phone calls and sending text messages. Uh, so this phone, in fact, all three of the phones that you're seeing uh, will be announced uh, within the next couple of uh, weeks to months and uh, will be hitting the market by Q1 of 2009.